Hello, this is Solar PV TV from InterSolar Munich 2017. And we are at the last day around 3 p.m., but still a lot of people here uh, at the booth of LTI. And at the booth of the company, which is now orchestrating the whole, let's say, energy system, yes, like we see on the, on the picture. And now we are with one of the guys who is a part of this orchestra. Uh, so he's working for uh, Clean Power Inc., uh, which is the investment and also brokerage for the project's company with Michael Ernst. So he was invited by LTI yes, to join the team also. And uh, yes, so he came from Boston and I would like to ask him first, so what is your feedback about InterSolar Munich? This is my first InterSolar Munich. I'm very happy to be here and I definitely plan to come back. It's been very productive. You've organized a great program here. Uh, I appreciate that, Tomasz. Okay, so why you are at the booth of LTI actually? I'm here because uh, actually uh, Michael Belmer at LTI helped introduce the solar international business to our company. We're American. We started developing wind and solar in the United States. But Michael introduced us to the opportunity to help developers all around the world uh, package their projects and sell them to investors. So let's say your business is to uh, bring these packages or I would say to bridge the project's owners uh, with the investors, yes? That's correct. And it's important to use tier one equipment, which is LTI equipment. It's important to the investors to have quality uh, equipment uh, for their investment. So, uh, Michael, we spoke, uh, I think, last year with uh, Mary O'Donnell. Hello, Mary. <laughs> so, Mary is uh, like a green businesswoman, yes? Yes. And she sent you here, so it means that uh, she feels a good business on the ground, yes? Well, um, this, this is a big trip. We're a small company, uh, and so we have to plan our, our uh, conferences uh, wisely. And uh, the uh, program that you organized in Shanghai was uh, very productive and introduced me to some new investors. And so uh, this has been terrific. Uh, uh, it's been very productive. Uh, thank you for introducing me to people and others, uh, Michael and others as well. Uh, so many new contacts who are interested in projects that we have. Have that range from Brazil to North Africa to the Philippines. So, so which kind of projects do you have now in the pipeline, let's say the most hot one? Well, we have uh, uh, the most hot are solar projects that are uh, 100 megawatts to 50 megawatts in uh, uh, North Africa, Nigeria, uh, and uh, in also in Brazil, uh, we have 50 megawatts uh, at a good price. Uh, so those are the big, the, the big ones. We also have some uh, wind and, and, and uh, uh, some transmission and some telecommunications projects as well. Okay. So uh, Mary is also um, building the sustainable village. Yes. And uh, what is the status actually? Well, that's uh, the reason Mary's not here this year. She's very busy uh, de developing a fairly large sustainable village of uh, currently 300 units of housing, oh. and it's mixed uh, mixed range uh, in terms of pricing, uh, from uh, you know moderate uh, in income all the way up to the high income with a. Uh, in, the, in the top stories with a view of the ocean because we're located a few miles from the ocean and, and this is right next to her wind farm and her organic farm in Kingston, Massachusetts, south of Boston. And it's, uh, it's underway, uh, uh, we're still uh, in, in the design phase and uh, I've also, you've introduced me so, to some good contacts uh, in terms of sustainable building design here uh, and incorporating not just solar panels on the roof, but also uh, high efficiency uh, opportunities uh, in the building design. So that's also been a good connection with some new people to uh, introduce to Mary that she's very happy about. So what are the next plans of uh, uh, Clean Power Inc? Well, we will continue uh, helping to identify investors for uh, the projects that we are working on, uh, as I mentioned, uh, across the world, and uh, continue meeting new investors. We always uh, are looking there. So many different investors have different uh, uh, appetite Desires. and interests, yes, for different countries, different technologies, and so uh, that's why it's always good to meet more investors, understand what they're interested in, and then as we meet more developers, we can make the right match. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, Michael, I hope uh, that uh, we meet next time in San Francisco, maybe in July. Yes. And uh, that was Solar PV TV together with uh, Michael Ernst, uh, who is uh, right hand of Mary O'Donnell at Clean Power Inc., the American company from Boston here in uh, Munich. Thanks for watching.